hello my beautiful scorpios welcome to my channel this is your favorite fortune teller divine light and today i'm gonna do a coffee cup reading for this upcoming uh, full moon energies and at the end of your reading i'm gonna pull some cards to get more clarity to a question in your mind also i'm gonna leave a link up here if you would like a private reading from me you can just go ahead and book your reading from there and also in the description box you can see by the way, only 30% of you haven't subscribed. If you're enjoying these videos, don't forget to hit subscribe. It's free. You can unsubscribe anytime you want. But it helps the channel a lot. And it also helps this message to get to the ones who really need to hear it as well. Okay? Let's jump into your reading. Let's see what is coming your way. All right, guys. Let's see. Okay, there's like a... You can see the lines, the phone lines, double phone lines, back and forth communication. There's an outside path opening for you. There is actually initially an offer will be coming through. This looks like a tulip. Tulip indicates resilience. This is actually something that you're creating for yourself, okay? This doesn't mean... Like, this is not going to be something unexpected. This is... When I say creating maybe already contemplating and planning in your mind and that energy will attract this thing to you okay the outside path can be an international travel interstate travel or can be like an offer also showing up for, for you for uh for from an area that you are not really considering or maybe you're not really thinking about but it is going to show up for you okay uh, not thinking about meaning you're thinking about it but it's not like um your general area of work okay i see there's a person here actually like looks like someone like laid back they have like a pipe in their mouth and there's actually a smoke shaped like aries coming through like a ram this can be someone in a leadership position they tend to do that and the pipe can be indicative of someone this person being like kind of reminded me of like sigmund freud has like this kind of like pictures with his pipe can be someone maybe in uh, psychotherapy or psychiatrist um maybe someone doing like mental work and helping people to improve their mental capacities like the you know um doing like different types of like hypnosis and stuff like that so this person is very laid back okay someone very experienced they have an eye on them so it can be um egyptian i won't i don't i don't really do like put this kind of like uh, international things on people the national things but eye of Ra just actually rem i remember the eye of Ra. Uh, this can be like related to that kind of like a sun energy okay this person's sun sign can be something you know related to this like creation energy i see here um or pharaohs maybe they have like egyptian uh, egyptologists i think there is actually like a university there i know there is a one in um like in most of the universities around the world but i'm not sure if that's the name that's what's called egypt egyptology okay so i have here this person is going to be actually changed like you're standing in front of them you're offering them a rose this can be like maybe if you're in an academic area you want upgrade maybe you're going to find a professor that you can work with a laid-back person right behind them i see a horse appearing this is like kind of like a symbolic horse here horses means wish fulfillment so when you actually come together with this person this is you're going to be very good for you this is going to be your wish fulfillment also you're holding up a fish in your hand this can be like maybe even writing a book together creating something together I'm, i know this is very specific whatever the situation in your life you can reapply it to and just you know re um interpret the situation but the work that you create with this person is actually going to break bring you some fish maybe you're not even going to bring uh create together with them you're just going to get their approval or maybe this is like if you're writing a book this is an editor that needs to read it go through it you know um so i see that there are going to be conversations happening with like uh, different types of levels there are two flowers and this looks like mushrooms growing on top of your head mushrooms also a very good sign of wealth because that's actually quick and fast growing and self-sustaining wealth is appearing here you're conversating with a w here w can be win or this can be in the first name or the last name of a person william watson um wilkinson i know this is like a name of brand i guess but yeah you're connecting with somebody and they are opening a brand new world a door they're standing on the door of a brand new world and there's also now it looks like letter h when i look at from this angel a a angle so 
Yes, and this is opening a different uh, world for you. You're stepping into an environment with probably very like-minded people. This can be like very intellectual environment if that's the case. I know this is like the what's coming in from my eyes is like um, um, like a cocktail party with people. Like not in the cocktail in the sense of like a, um, like a youngsters, but in the sense of um, I don't know if you guys have ever been to like um operas or stuff like that when they have a recession you see the people coming um and in the the hallway and um this is my experience i i don't know if that happens in every country but like you can see that environment is different than um, when you go to movies to see avengers okay so um they don't really have in some countries they don't even have recessions but some people some countries have still like in the movies but like uh it's different than like an opera scene or um like a theater scene so i feel like that's going to be the environment that you're going to be stepping into okay and the people probably you're going to have like embraced in that environment people are hugging together here and this is going to be like a very change of energy and you're right here and getting on another horse with that energy is going to actually upgrade you to another level okay let's get into your plate now if you have a question a desire and intention hold it in your mind let's see what the answer is going to be like sometimes the things that i'm saying i don't even believe like what i'm saying like why am i even talking about this but i feel like this is like a channeled message coming through uh so like take what resonates with you if it doesn't resonate with you it's a general reading and the message coming through is actually like sometimes weird why did i even talk about that i'm thinking now <laughs> like the okay whatever that you're desiring is actually going to be manifesting very soon seems like here okay yeah, and it's actually uh, closing one cycle and opening up a new one. I see here you're packing up and moving forward. And there's a very wide lane opening for you. Very long path and a wide lane is opening for you. And I see again this like animal with a long beak. Like I saw it, I interpreted it as a dog. But now like no, a horse. But it's not a horse. Now I see it. This looks like an elephant here that one that you're riding this one looks like i don't know maybe a crow and this is again this kind of reminds me of kind of like a bear bear in the case authority power and strength crow can be because they're super smart i saw like recently somebody actually trained a crow to bring them the loose like the change or the money they, they find on the street they train them okay so that's they're like trainable but and um that indicates maybe there is an area that you can train yourself very well and this will actually with a bear indicates power strength authority and managerial uh you know you know managerial positions and stuff like that when you train yourself in that area there's probably going to be a massive upgrade happening in your life and this bear and the crow are aligned so it's not going to be taking too long for you okay this card was on the bottom it wanted to come out so this is nine of cups here nine of cups is actually indicative of wish fulfillment all your wishes are aligning and your wishes are coming to life no worries love of life okay the more you love the life that you're living the better is it, it is going to get it seems like here you can use affirmations if you're having a hard time to feel that energy while you're doing your daily chores while, chores while your mind is open to receiving for example first thing in the morning usually comes through um you can use like affirmation tapes we have the three of cups here which indicates celebration with family a celebration a wedding graduation or a, a news of birth um like a pregnancy in the in the family and need, need to have a, little, a lot more fun so usually when you have the two pentacles it actually says like you need to if you're working hard you need to play hard but this card also gives this message as well if you're feeling like you need uh, to have a little bit more relaxed time for yourself this is actually coming through we have the number 15 the ego card this is actually the capricorn energy uh, archangel Raphael is telling you uh, you have a false sense of entrapment and uh, you are focusing on the material things more than you should be and um, negative and 
fear-based thoughts okay so let's see what is going to actually clear that up like your life is going to get better but if you have you know walking away six of swords we have here everything is going to be all right everything is actually going the right path end of a challenging time going for a travel and six of swords is actually going from choppy waters to the calmer shores so you're going to be moving on we're moving away from that energy that you're feeling that negativity okay that is going to actually be left behind if you have it right now all right my beautifuls that's all for today hope you enjoy your reading if you do don't forget to give this one a thumbs up and if you want to see more of these go ahead and subscribe to my channel i wish you all a magical day bye